guys, it's Anna, I'm Kelsey, and today we're going to be doing turning this girly doll right here into an emo. So it'll be fun. By the way, I haven't done my proper makeup, I just did a quick bit of makeup, so. And I've already got my base layer done, so. For base layer, we just did foundation and two separate concealers. That one went under the eye, only under the eye, a little bit here, and like where it's a bit red because it's a lighter colour. And then I used the darker colour for like redness, getting rid of that. And also under the eyes to get rid of some dark circles and stuff. Okay. So, now. Face powder, finish powdering your face. Which would be a translucent powder, which is Primark because I, I, I couldn't be bothered to find another one. So this was just the first one I came across in my drawer. Move your face towards me, I can't do it if you're facing me. No, go back. Seriously, you knew what I meant. Why am I letting you do this? Because you love me. Do I? Yes. Okay. Thankfully, my laptop does not um, like get knocked because I was the camera was pulled down. Okay. Your what? I said hopefully my laptop doesn't get knocked. Go like this. Go like that. I'm just following the natural drawline. Okay, stop. Blend that out now. And that contour. Unfortunately, sometimes I like it too much. Don't take out. You are turning into a bit of a fairy. A fairy? Yeah, I like fairies. Glitter. Okay, now it's ready. Glitter! I'm just using this highlighter that I got in an eyeshadow palette because I can't find my highlighter. I think I dropped it and it smashed or something like ages ago because I usually don't bother with highlighter. I just do the contour and that's about it. Okay, I'm not going to bother bonding you because I see the eye of life. Stop doing that to my leg. Okay. Now it's time for eyeshadow. I can't remember how I did this. This was just a free step. So I'm going to do something similar to this. But it's not going to be this. Because this is a masterpiece that cannot be done again. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to start with the outside and then work my way in. So I'm going to start with the black on the outer corner. And I'm going to mix it with this brown in the middle. I'm going to get you to shut your eyes so that I don't prod you. And I'm also going to take it along the crease. And right down to here. Even. Okay. I think you're going to look like you're beaten up by the end of this, I think. Okay, so now I'm going to mix the... <laughs> Middle brown with this brown with this white, okay? And I'm just going to put it on here and blend the black into that all the way down the eyes. And then I'm going to get this one down here. And I'm going to put it right in the middle of that eye. And you're going to have a very glittery, let's make your eye. <laughs> and now close. I'm gonna get rid of all of that excess black stuff and off your eye. Okay, so there's one eye done. You look like you were beaten up badly. You did it. Did it really hard. I beat them up. Look up. I have never done somebody else's makeup 
humor makeup is my thing. So. Now you tell me. Yep. I didn't tell you because I just wanted to do this. Okay, fine. Do. Do. And blend, 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 blend. Look up! Common sense! Don't like eye things in my eyes. Well, I'm not putting anything in your eye. I'm putting it near your eye. Except for um, eyelash colours. Like eyelashes. And shears. Mascaras. Yeah, alright. You get it. And then I'm going to do the same on the other eye and we'll be right back. Okay. So, this is how her makeup turned out. I am very proud of this. Okay, so now, even though you're blonde, I'm going to be making your eyebrows brown with this brown mascara because I can't bind my eyebrow tints there because, yeah, I'm down my dad's and I have to bring my makeup down here. I wasn't planning on doing this, so I'm useless. I'm going to shape your eyebrows as best as I can because no offence but you really need to tidy them up someday yeah I'm getting them done so I do my own <laughs> only because I see the age to go out and have them done because I have to explain to them what you want them to look like and I just give up with that stuff okay now Oh, my favourite part is with the mascara. Okay, so like blink, blink, keep blinking, just keep blinking until I tell you to stop. Open it properly and then shut. Okay, you, you, you do it yourself and try to keep them as long as you bloody can. If it don't work, just let me know when I get my eyelash curler out. Do you usually need eyelash curler? You probably should do it in the camera quickly. That's what she does. We're going to pause it and do that and then we'll be right back. Okay, so that's as good as it's going to get with her. So, that's the makeup done. Now it's time for the hair and then it's time for the clothes, which I've already picked out. So, <laughs> what side, left or right? Which side? Just pick a side. I'm not going to tell you what I'm doing. That side? Okay. Let's find your fringe there. You have a very small fringe. I'm not going to bother pinning your hair back to make a side fringe because I really can't be asked of that because it just takes too long to actually fix it and I've forgot my extensions that make black like my black extensions by the way if you think I should get side fringe cap because my mum's not let me get, get it until at least one other person than Kelsey thinks I should get it done at least so I'm gonna have a side fringe cap and I'm gonna dye it black black is definite but the side fringe I might not be getting. So I'm going to do your hair like that. doesn't really need straightening. So we're going to get under the clothing. So I'm going to show you I selected her. She's going to put it Quite on. Quite like this. Yeah, she's going to put it on. And then we'll be right back. Okay, right. So I don't have my band tees down here. So I got Kelsey to give me one of her tops, which is Izzy's one. Because I'm wearing my top right now, which is the one I really like. But yeah, this one. So she's going to be wearing this. The bottoms. I, she, I haven't got any other black jeans. Also left them at my mum's. So we've got some jackins for her. I think they should be okay. We can style them to be good. And then we've just got a nice leather jacket. Well, full leather jacket thing. Which is what would be nice. So she's going to put them on and I'm going to style them with accessories, e.g. choker. Which I do have down here for once, unfortunately. It's a blue one! Because, you know. Yeah, stuff. So we're going to be back once we've done all that. Okay, so. This is what she looks like. We'll get an overview. Stand up, mate. So that's the top. And this is going to be really hard to do. Yeah, 
I was going to give him a military boots, but yeah, that is what she is wearing. <gasps> okay, so obviously she's got to sit down because I haven't finished. She's gonna have to put some lipstick on, whilst I find something for her. Okay, she's just using my massive mirror that we had to move to film this video. <laughs> you done? Yes, you have. Come on. I have to do it first. No, you're not a girly girl, okay? That looks better. It's red. I had to substitute for that colour compared to the coffee brown and stuff. So, this is the finished look. Of course, if you want people to know that you are emo, you cannot go without writing this on your face. I'm sorry, I just had to do this for the video purposes, okay, girls? Do not take hard feelings. This is very good artwork, though. It takes very long to do. If you were emo, you would understand this beautiful architecture. To the face. I have no clue what I'm talking about right now. And that is how people know you are emo. <laughs> you could also do this just to add some effect. First time doing this on other person. I'm the other person as well. Is that? Yeah. Well, that sounds weird, doesn't it? And you put. And you hear some. Nope. Just because you do listen to them, that's the only actual emo thing about you is the music you listen to. Just, you can't move your mouth from doing that. Else I'll draw all over you. Like I just did because you're smiley. There you go. That's how people know you're emo. You, you look like this. You have the beautiful black bear brides and I'm emo on your face. Okay, so, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please do not take this last part seriously. Because if you do, you are definitely not an emo. I don't think people need to see this in your face just to know that you are emo. Can I rub it off yet? No, you're keeping this on for the rest of the day once <laughs> we go downtown. What? <laughs> oh no! Oh no, Annabelle! I'm joking, you can rub it off later. Later? What do you mean later? By the way, if you cannot find a uh, um, fishnet glove thing, you, if you know, you know what I'm on about, just get an old woman glove, cut the fingers off and there you go. Beautiful. You're done. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Please do not take this seriously and do it, because it, it, you'll just be humiliated. Even to emails, you'll be humiliated. Okay? They will hum I can't even talk. They will humiliate, humiliate you. you. Okay? I can't even say it. That would be like writing, I am a doofus. Or, oh, yeah. Or, I am a nerd, when you look like a nerd. Or, I am very pretty, when you are very pretty. Unlike moi. Moi. You're pretty. You're not. pretty. <laughs> or, I'm fat, like I am. I'm me. I'm me. I'm me. Fatness is real. But anyway. Fatness. Okay, so. I hope you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and comment down below what you think we should do next and if you like disney that's cool too but if you like disney uh -huh, that's cool anyway i hope you like this bye, bye.